I haven't really had the chance to make any R&B or trap sort of beats recently. I believe Drake has a new album on the way, so basically going to use this video as preparation for when that comes out. So as you probably guessed, today I'm going to be making a couple of beats in the style of Scissor and Bryson and Tiller. This video was made possible by Producer Related, which is a company that mainly sells loop kits, sound banks, preset banks, stuff like that. And they've recently sent me their Euphoria loop kit to check out. From my understanding, it includes 10 original compositions, all produced by Titan, and all conveniently in the style that I'm looking to make today, so... As you can see, 10 original compositions. Let's try this one first. I think I can do something with this one. I wanna take it in a different direction though, I think. I think it's best that I add some effects first before I move on. I want to add like one more melodic element just to put my own spin on it though. I found this vocal sample which sounds pretty cool but... Definitely need some effects because right now it sounds kind of whack. Now I'm just going to move on to the drums. I'm being completely carried by the sample. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get finessed by the comments. I feel like a subtle kick would go better with this beat, but I'm just addicted to things that destroy my speakers, so. I wanted a more central vocal element to the beat, so I'm adding this like single vox chop that I found in some random pack. I remember using this thing all the time when I was like 15 years old, but it sounds like this. There's a couple parts of the sample that I don't really like, so I chopped them out. I'm just gonna mix up the whole beat and see what it sounds like at the end.
the second sample I picked out is way slower, way more chill, and it sounds like this. Pick this one because I really like the gated pad effect that it had going on. First, what I'm going to do is up the pitch a little bit by like four semitones or something. I'm gonna add a couple of my own melodic elements just so it's not an easy drag and drop. Now I'm gonna look for a Vox sample to add to this, just to fill the melody out a little bit. Now that's a vibe. The melody's not wide enough for me, so I'm gonna add a couple of one-shots. I'm running out of one-shots that I haven't used a thousand times already. <laughs> gonna lay like a couple on top of each other because why not this one sounds a bit too sinister but I'm gonna work with it anyway the most difficult part of the whole process. I'm gonna have to bring all these elements together in the mix. so chill. I'm gonna keep the beat really open and leave the drums like this. So I'm just gonna mix them up, arrange the beat, and we'll see what we got. done it's that simple i think they perfectly fit the rmp drake scissor vibe both very chill very simple and i like how open the loops i used were to adding other melodic elements once again thank you to producer related and prod by titan for providing the loops and once again if you're interested in using some of these for your own production there's an affiliate link in the description hopefully if you're looking for some inspiration this video helped in some way if you enjoyed obviously feel free to like and subscribe let's just listen to the beat and see what i could do better for next time